Bowman here from BW1.com and I'm going to show you how to update your PS Vita. Now the PS Vita just recently came out and there is an update available for it and uh, just in case you don't get a notification to the system and you hear about us somewhere through a friend or online, you at least know how to go through the update process and get it, get it there manually. So all you need to do is go down here to where it says settings. You want to tap the settings icon, you want to start the settings here and you want to tap on system update. Now there's three different options to do as far as um, doing this update. You can update using Wi-Fi. You can update by connecting it to a PS3 system so you can just use the USB cable and plug it into your PS3 and use the PS3's internet connection to update. You can also update by connecting to a PC. You do need to download the, uh, you need to download and install the content uh, manager assistant. I think that's what it's called, content manager assistant application on your PC to get it to do that. But um, in this update, we're gonna do update over Wi-Fi. So we're just gonna tap the Wi-Fi option there, wait for it to connect. All right, you see a new version of the system software is available, version 1.61, we'll hit next. The system will close all applications as used. Do you want to, to continue? Yep. All right, it's gonna obviously make you read this little agreement here. So you wanna read through that, or if you don't wanna read through that, just speed down to the bottom and hit accept. And it tells you what the new features are. Maps have been added to the home screen. Photos can now record video. So we know what's there. Hit next. Do you want to update the system software? Do not power up the system during installation. You might, you know, harm it and stuff like that. As you can see there. We'll just hit update. And it's downloading. It says it has about two minutes left. Okay, the update is complete there. I would say total time is anywhere between about eight to 12 minutes for that particular update, depending on your Wi Fi connection and such. Let's go ahead and power this back on again here. There we go. Swipe it open. All right, let's verify some of the updates here. So maps, we see new maps icon is right there. We also see the photos as well too. I'm supposed to be able to uh, record a video. So do a quick test of that. Yep, yep, you know, all right. There we go, video there. Yep, you can see you can record video, pretty cool. And I switched the cameras there so you can record in the front and rear as well too. So that's just verifying a couple of the updates there and um, basically how to update your PS, PS Vita. Really simple, really easy to use. So this is Bowman here from BW1.com reminding you to subscribe to our YouTube page, follow us on Twitter, become a fan of our Facebook fan page, also circle us on Google+. Plus. Um, follow us on Pinterest as well too and um, check out our main website at BW1.com. The link to that and all our social media is in the description. And always remember to live your tech world in high definition.